Shia's dam also getting more and more empty. So it's more of a perfect mud wallow than a drinking water hole now. Let's just look at that. Some of those buffalo are really enjoying it. Good opportunity for some stills photographs as well. This is a fantastic bachelor group, there's so many of them, well over 20 that we can see from here. And there's one of the, one of the things that buffalo bulls or dugger boys like doing is, is this is mud wallowing. You can see this mud is very, very thick, they sink in almost to their bellies. It's like walking through lava. Also gives these buffalo the opportunity to really get themselves nicely covered in mud. This bull that we're watching now, I can see he's shaking his head quite a lot. Getting some of that mud off his horns. Look at those guys as well walking away. You can see they've really got themselves nice and covered. I'm sure most of you already know why, but it's just again perfect way to cool themselves. It's been quite a hot, stuffy sort of clammy day almost so it definitely cools them down also gives them a sort of a factor 30 or a factor 40 sun cover you can imagine a thick layer of mud all over their skin gets rid of parasites and ticks also gets dead of rid of dead skin flakes exfoliates them and I'm sure it just feels good as well <laughs> I do like buffalo they just have such Attitude, I think, is maybe the best word I can think of. Randy from Nevada. Randy, you were just asking, what's my least favorite animal? No, that's going to be a very difficult question. And I I'm, I'm, don't want to sound cliched when I say that I probably don't have one. Um, people often ask you, what's your least favorite or most favorite? And it's a little bit like asking, what's my least favorite food? Or my most favorite food? My least favorite animal, I would probably have to put humans at the top of that list. For the things they can get themselves to do. Then again, one of my favorite animals also, almost certainly human. So, maybe to answer your question more in the way you meant it, I presume you meant more sort of of the things we see out here. Um, it's really difficult to say, Andy. It's, I think humans definitely would feature at the top and at the bottom end of that list just because I'm one of them. Mosquitoes, don't like mosquitoes very much, especially when they give you malaria or they keep you awake the whole night. But uh, I can't really say I've got a least favorite animal. I do have some kind of appreciation for all of them. But if it comes to mind suddenly, if I think of one that fits in that category, I'll let you know again. I think it's just follow these buffaloes for a little bit. See what they get up to. 